Hey everyone, this is Kurisu, and tonight we're going to be working on some more Kurisu Fox fan canon artwork. Um, so you're all welcome to make any suggestions in chat. Um, obviously we want those suggestions to be appropriate. Um, but aside from that, on screen right now I have a few different ideas for my logo for my Fox boxes on my website. Um, so I will give you all the option to let me know which one is your favorite. Um, so far, the majority of people have preferred option number three, but um, I've considered combining some of the parts and pieces from the other designs. Oh no, your frames broke. That sucks. I don't know. I think if I was going to use the text from any of the others for number three, I would probably be more likely to use the text from option one without the ears and tail on it since those are already on the box. Aw, thanks Sniper. I appreciate that. Thank you, he says hi. <laughs> he always gets really talkative right before I stream and during. But he doesn't usually bark that much, he just wants to be the center of attention, maybe. One moment. Hey, what are you yelling about? Come here. You want pets? No? Okay, stay over there, I guess. That's a hard choice to pick. Yeah, I understand. That is actually the reason why I asked everybody else. Um, well, one reason. Um, I also kind of just want everyone's input since it's something that, like, will be available for everyone who is interested in, like, purchasing any of those mystery boxes on my website. He wants more artwork of himself? Oh my gosh. Um, hey, welcome to chat, CB. How's it going? Glad to hear it. Um, so tonight we are working on, well, we will be working on some more Kurisu fan canon artwork. Um, uh, let's see. Your official suggestion is Dark Kurisu or Shin Kurisu or Naked Kurisu or whatever. Just some kind of polar counterpart to Kurisu. Maybe even Gender Band, I don't know. Whatever you want to do. Huh. Maybe. I'll definitely keep those options in mind. Um. Yeah. So... <laughs> Yeah, everyone is welcome to make whatever suggestions they like, and then once we sort of get some ideas out there, um, I'll let everyone kind of decide together what we're doing. Um, again, it does have to be, like, stuff that's appropriate, like it has to be safe for work content. Um, but that said, as long as we're making artwork that doesn't have a background, which I don't plan on making anything with a background right now, I plan on probably making any fan canon artwork we make into different sticker designs, so keep that in mind as well if that's something that you would like to see in my shop. So yeah, uh, what other suggestions do we have? What hat would I wear? What color would it be? Um, so in real life, um, I'd probably have a hat with fox ears, but if 
it were a hat that Kurisu was wearing. She already has yours, so that might look kind of silly. Um, but maybe like, um, you know the knitted sort of like hats that people usually use for like skiing or whatnot? I've heard them called several different things, so I tend to not like give them a label, but the ones with like the little poof on top. Um, it'd probably be something like that with, uh, with holes for Curiousu's ears. Um, does Curiousu- Dark- does Dark Curiousu have different piercings than Curiousu or the same? Um, I'm not sure. Straw hats? No. I- I don't wear straw hats. I don't like the way they feel. Like, in general, I don't really like to have things on my head. Um, but that said, when it's warmer out, or warmer out, when it's colder out, I do occasionally wear something to keep my head warm. Just because I like to be warm, but not really any other reason. Because I don't really consider them comfortable. Yeah, a beanie could work as far as the label there. Um, make a pic of both Dirk and normal Kurisu looking at each other. Oh my gosh. If I do that, it's probably... I could see it being more like... Not quite a half body, probably just like from the arms up, like, I picture them having their arms crossed and, like, kind of back-to-back -back glaring at each other, like, side-eyeing each other. <laughs> hey, how's it going, Julius? Welcome to chat. What cloak would Kurisu wear during a battle? Um, that's hard to say. Like, it would probably, like, if she was wearing a cloak, it would be, like, um, the one that she was wearing in the artwork with, um, with Huey. Probably. Um. Because as far as cloaks go, Kurisu prefers something that's more like low profile, not really super flashy, because, uh. While she's kind of like a magic user, she's also like kind of stealthy. So. Things that don't really make her stand out. Kurisu is the Grim Reaper. I mean. That would definitely work, considering that she uses a scythe as her primary weapon. Uh, does anyone else have any recommendations for the artwork? I'm just trying to give everybody the opportunity to throw something out there because I want everyone to have a say who wants to be involved. Uh, minus the wings, the celestial robe would be more stealthy. I mean, yes and no. Because um, with Kurisu's coloration, like with the orange and white primarily, I think that would make it easier to spot her versus wearing something dark, especially if she's moving around at night. Um, it kind of just depends on the situation, though. Because, like, as far as something being more lightweight, I definitely agree with you, though, Hunter. The third one is better. Awesome. I appreciate that. Uh, you think Dark Kurisu should be more flashy than light? You know... It's funny, because, like, I've kind of always pictured Kurisu as more of, like, an equilibrium rather than being light or dark. So, like, I don't know. In order to properly depict that, there'd probably have to be three versions, and I don't want to do that. 
like to have one that's like actually light and actually dark. What other ideas do we have? What would Kurisu look like in inverted colors? Um, so like, in terms of like, technically inverted, um, her fur would probably be blue, um, because that is the opposite of the orange. Uh, the white would probably be, well I mean, because it's more of like, a light cream color would be kind of like a dark, let's see, like a really dark purple, maybe? Nigger Sue, oh my gosh. And then her hair would be white though, because that's the opposite of the black. Hey, thanks for following! Is that... Let's see, how do we pronounce that? Do you go by TX or do you go by something else? Because I don't want to call you by the wrong name here in, in the stream. Alright. <laughs> You know, that would have been really funny if you actually meant to say you can't just call me T. Um, but yeah, welcome to welcome to chat, T. We're glad to have you here. Um, let's see. But the black robe would be uh, pretty sure you mean hassle due to the length. But with the celestial robe, you can add camo type paint or camo as well. Eh, I don't know. Because, like, it really depends because. Reese is kind of used to moving around with loose fitting clothes like that. Um, let's see. Because, like, especially with her being primarily a magic user in terms of fighting, like, I think it just makes more sense to have the longer robe, um, like the black one, because, like, it's not so much, like, physical attacks in the majority of cases. Uh, since you have fox ears, do you wear normal headphones or Bluetooth headphones? Um... actually oh you mean like wireless i actually have a headset it's more comfortable i don't really like putting headphones in my ears unless i have to or it's just like i don't know like i would say i'd be more likely to try to sleep with like wireless earbuds but in general i prefer like over the ear headphones um just because i think those are more comfortable but that said, it's hard to find some that are light enough that the part on top of my head doesn't cause pain after a while. Which, thankfully, my current headset isn't awful. Like, it does get a little bit uncomfortable after extended periods, but we haven't really been, like, having streams that are long enough for that to be an issue, so <laughs> not worried about it right now. Um, but yeah, do we have- oh! Let's see, so why do you have headphones on your head and not on your ears? Um, in this particular case, it just looks better, um, like aesthetically. Because like, when I actually put them on my ears, it just looks kind of silly. <laughs> like, it looks more silly than just having them on the side of my head. Um, but yeah, do we have any more recommendations for our artwork tonight? Uh, you never liked 
stud headsets. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean, Hunter. earbuds okay yeah i mean my biggest complaint with earbuds is that they don't usually fit properly in my ears so like if i try to wear them for extended periods they usually fall out um but yeah um they don't really make many headphones anymore that are just like wired without being lower quality so I don't usually use those unfortunately like I used to really like the well, I mean like I don't know because I do like the earbud style as far as like headphones because it's like convenient I guess it just really depends on the situation Yeah, I mean, like, the main reason why I prefer wireless- or not wireless, the reason I prefer wired headsets is because I'm less likely to lose them. Um, but like I said, that's just because the ones that don't have wires just don't fit well enough. How's Huey feeling today? Um, he's just kind of laying down right now in front of the fan. You like the ones that clip over your ear and don't stick in your ear? See, I like those also, but I like the ones that both clip over your ear and, like, fit inside. Um, because, like, the ones that just sit on your ear, um, don't fit me because I have really small ears. <laughs> like, not really small, but small enough that most of those don't really work for me. Uh, but yeah. Any other recommendations for our artwork tonight? I'm probably gonna go ahead and get started pretty soon. Um, if we want to kind of discuss what we're gonna end up making tonight, I will leave that up to everyone in chat. I can open a last example though. Um, so I'm going to open our most recent and first uh, Kirisu fan cannon artwork. Let me find here. There we are. Um, so this is our first fan cannon artwork. Um, over here we have my dog um, who chat has decided to name Huey and he is riding on a pair of unknown origin. Uh, we have no idea where it came from. We don't know if it's magic and levitates or if Huey makes it levitate. Um, it's kind of just a mystery and then we just have Kurisu over here hanging out with him. Uh, let's see. Uh, that's good to hear. How about Fox Den with you and Huey? Um, I don't really want to do anything with the background tonight. Um, because right now, I kind of want to turn our fan cannon artwork into stickers. Because I think that's a lot of fun. Um, and I don't really like to make stickers with backgrounds. Just because, like, the way I cut things out, they just don't look as nice like they can but as far as the shape it would probably just end up being like a square shaped sticker instead of like the actual shape of the artwork uh don't know if you heard paul rubens aka Wee herman passed away at 70 that's unfortunate i never really watched any of his stuff but um yeah i feel sorry for his family 
and everyone who was close to him because that's always rough. Good sniper. There's no need to apologize. Um, I was just making note of that because I, I just don't really want to make a background for this. Let's see. Could you do one with Chibi Kurisu smacking an air conditioner unit with a wrench? Oh my gosh. Yeah, we could consider that. Um, so let's see what options we have considered so far, because I know we talked about <laughs> Dark Kurisu, uh, we talked about, um, let's see, talked about GB Kurisu with the air conditioner, Huey says hi again, let's see, so those were the two main uh, suggestions that I remember seeing in here. Were there any others that I missed? That's how I... <laughs> Chibi Dark Kurisu, oh my gosh. Um... That's how I do it from the motherland of the fox. Oh my gosh, Hunter. Um, actually, how about you in an adventure in adventure clothing and Huey could be like a fairy or firefly like Sparks from Spyro. Oh my gosh. Um, let's see. So there's that. <laughs> there's that option. We have Chibi Kurisu with the air conditioner and a wrench. We have Dark Chibi Kurisu. Um, we also have like Dark Kurisu with Kurisu. Um, so yeah. Uh, between those options, which one do you all like the most? Yeah, because as far as a piece with, like, Dark Kurisu and Kurisu in the same piece together, like, I just picture it having, like, similar vibes to, like, Shadow the Hedgehog and Sonic, <laughs> but that's just me. Yeah, he is very talkative tonight. Gonna have to quiet down soon though, because it's almost nine. We want to be considerate of our neighbors. You're gonna stick with your TV Kurisu smacking the air conditioner with a wrench. Alright, so I'm gonna say if we do TV Kurisu, it's going to be probably the one with the air conditioner and the wrench. Um, what do you think about? Do you want to come over here and get bet pets? Next scritches? What do you want? What do you want? Oh, okay. Kurisu is a Pokemon trainer and Huey is a Pokemon. They all say hi to you. Oh, let's see. 
so yeah anyway um if we do chibi kirisu it is probably gonna be the one with the wrench and the air conditioner um let's see <laughs> you see he is midday like in rock um i don't know what are you doing what are you doing Yeah, he's being tricky right now. Because <laughs> he's acting like he wants something. And he's doing that thing where he... Doesn't want pets because he's not letting me. But now he is. So... He's just being silly right now. You <laughs> got them vocals. Oh my gosh, Sniper. He wants to be a lap, Huey. I mean, he can. Uh, right now, my computer is set up on my floor, so that's been fun. Um, But he is not acting on that right now, so that makes things a little easier to deal with, I guess. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and close this. Minimize that, because I was still working on it. Why are you yelling? Come here. Over here, please. Chibi Kurisu with the air conditioner sounds good. Oh my gosh. Alright. So, spam emotes. Which expression do you want Chibi Kurisu to have? Our. Um, air conditioner. Hey! Do you want to say hi to everybody? Is that what you want? Come over here. Come over here. No? You're getting shy as soon as you're the center of attention? That's okay. So now you want to talk. Hey, listen. Listen, can you use your inside voice, please? Hey, use your inside voice, please. It's starting to get late. Okay. Can you please use your inside voice? Alright. So, is that final for Chibi Kirisu with the air conditioner? Or do we have... Um, got some pocket monster cards in at work today with Japanese text and some gold Pokemon cards. That's awesome. The gold cards are always really cool to see because, like, they're not super common. Are you talking about the gold foil or, like, were they, like, some sort of special edition that was, like, gold? Like, they had a- the, uh, what restaurant was it? I think they had, like, an event at Burger King in the 90s. Was it something like that or, like, actual playing cards? Grace, you suffer heat with no air conditioner, but Huey puts it in the tub. What? Gold foil playing cards. Yeah, those are really cool. Do you remember which Pokemon they were? Because I think... Let's see. I think I got one one time that was like out of Kazam, maybe. Hey. You're so talkative tonight. So talkative. Right. Awesome. I look forward to seeing those. Um, so yeah, are we... Actually, you still have Pokemon cards in a box that you have sitting in your closet? I totally understand that. 
Because I have like, let's see. I have like 10 or 12 cases, like not cases, but 10 or 12 of the um, trainer boxes that I haven't opened yet. So I totally get that. Oh my gosh. Um, but yeah. On that note, if I ever get my camera set up so that I can have two cameras, I might consider doing like some box openings, but we'll see. So, are we deciding for uh, Chibi Kurisu with the air conditioner, or are we going with another option? Because I think that's the one that I keep seeing the most. Because it was pretty much down to that, like between that and Dark Kurisu. Which, if I if I do Dark Kurisu, it's probably going to be like sort of like a mirror image uh, with both. Yeah, what do you all think? Oh, uh, when you say a box, you literally have- You act have an actual box, literally, you steer fishing box that had all your lures and hooks in it. Oh my gosh. Alright. Um, so unfortunately, Twitch does not <laughs> seem to be working when I try to open a poll. Because it's supposed to open a menu when I do slash pull. Okay, so I'm not going to be able to open a poll. But do we want... Uh, dark Kurisu with Kurisu, or do we want Chibi Kurisu with the air conditioner? So we're gonna go with Chibi Kurisu and her air conditioner. Start with the head. Oh yeah. Um, so, I am not sure which expression I want to use. If you all want to spam your favorite Kurisu emotes, or, like, which expression we want to put on her face. Oh my gosh. That is one that I had in mind. Delete that layer. Start over. I don't know what you want, doggo. Maybe a 
is being very talkative tonight. Yeah, that was a big woof. Uh, let's see. Peaches. What are you talking about, Hunter? Um, um but yeah, any good meals? I made noodles last night so that I could have them for lunch today. And, like, they weren't bad, but I don't think I'm gonna make that particular kind of noodles again for lunch like the night before if i do i'm gonna have to do it like the day of because they're not not as good otherwise Actually, you're going to make some after the stream. That sounds good. Yeah, ramen is pretty great. Oh, I'm not familiar, Hunter. Um, so we decided on Chibi Kurisu smacking an air conditioner with a wrench. Or her band hammer if it gets worse. Oh my gosh. Uh, I totally would hit the air conditioner with my band hammer, but I don't think that would make it any better. If anything, it would probably work even worse. That's just my two cents. So we don't want to ban the air conditioner. When you say smacking the air conditioner, you mean like just slapping it or like literally just smashing it to pieces. Oh my gosh. Um, so I actually kind of pictured Kurisu with a rather large wrench, like getting ready to hit the air conditioner, like if it were a baseball bat. <laughs> that was a bonk. Oh my gosh, you ridiculous foxtrot.
like those ranches for mechanics. What are you talking about, Sniper? I am not familiar. Oh, wrench is my mistake. Oh, you're fine, Sniper. I just needed to make sure that I was on the same page. We do have a box end wrench or a monkey wrench. Um, I was thinking like um, let's see, not a monkey wrench. Like, I I don't know proper terminology because I don't generally use wrenches in my daily life. Um, but like like the silver ones <laughs> that you'd usually see, like. Um, let's see. I think... One moment. So I remember, like, Ratchet and Clank, I could have sworn that Ratchet used a wrench as his primary weapon. It, it would be kind of similar to that. Uh, you're gonna send a picture on Discord. What wrench would you use? Oh, of what wrench I would use? Alright, let's see it. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, cards that you sent in chat. Let's see, that was Kuro, wasn't it? Because some of those look like they're like the older cards. Um, that's really cool though. Good sniper, there's no rush. What are you yelling about? He's doing his big tiny borks right now. So, uh, for anybody who's here and isn't in my Discord server, um, if that's something that you would like to join, you're welcome to send me a private message and I am happy to send you a link, like an invite link, after my stream. 
Um, I mostly just don't share it in chat because I like to prevent bots from being able to join. And that, I think, is a pretty efficient deterrent. Because most bots aren't going to know how to send a private message. Like, not when being asked to do so. Let's see here. Is the wrench you sent in Discord the wrench we'll be using? Uh, let's see real quick. Uh, yeah, something like that, just really big. Oh my gosh. Yeah, um, and that is exactly how this air conditioner and the artwork is going to feel as well.
drink too much I tell myself that I can stop we could see clearly now we could see clearly Boho wants to know if you're more of a yip 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 fox or a <laughs> ahi ahi poo fox. Oh my gosh. Um. So, I would say I would probably be more of like a like just single loud screech <laughs> fox, <laughs> where like it's completely unexpected. And like you hear it and you're startled, but you don't know where it came from and it doesn't happen again. Um, back. Sorry, finding some clips for you. Uh, okay. Welcome back, Hunter. Oh my gosh, Julius. Full body screech box. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. Behold, Scrim. Ah! <laughs> Oh my gosh, you're hilarious. Let's see, couldn't find the wrench I had, but did find a picture of what it looks like. Alright. I uh, want to see what a scream looks like when you drive past it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I mean, that's fair, Sniper. <laughs> So let's check this out real quick. Oh yeah, um, that is very much along the lines of what I have in mind, Sniper.
Oh, thanks, CB. I appreciate that. Is it true, though? I definitely see Carissa using that type of wrench on the air conditioner. Yeah, definitely. That is 100% what I had in mind. How many eggs can curry you eat in one sitting? Oh, um, let's see. How many eggs can I eat? Um, I'd probably go for three, but I could, I could eat maybe like five or six. It depends. <laughs> um, it also depends on how they're prepared, though. Um. Oh my gosh, Julius used my Hydrate Redeem. So tonight I am drinking some water. I wish my avatar would pick up. There it goes. Alright, and that portion of our stream was staying hydrated with Kurisu. Yay, hydration. <laughs> Uh, what's your favorite way to prepare an egg? Um, so it depends. Is it um, a dish that's mostly egg or like an option that's just egg with like seasonings or other stuff added? Because like, I've always really enjoyed quiche, um, which is kind of like, um, I mean, it's kind of like an omelet pie, almost. <laughs> um, but as far as like, if it's just eggs, I would say I really like scrambled eggs because I don't really prefer the yolk by itself, I like the flavor of it. But that said, I do also like boiled eggs. Those are nice. Awesome. I appreciate you for stopping by, CB. Have a great night. You like sunny side up or omelets? Yeah, those are pretty good too.
Oh my gosh. You ridiculous sniper. Yeah, I've never seen uh, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure either. Let's see, Hunter says, I used to enjoy having those miniature beef slash pork pies. You know, I don't think I've ever had any before. Like, are you talking about, like, the frozen pot pies? Because I've, I've had chicken before, but I've never had any other flavor. kind of out of place. Looks a little better, I think. Uh, let's see, what was my favorite episode from an anime? That is actually probably... I don't know if I can answer that or not, because most anime I've watched I don't tend to like just one episode, um, and I think in order to share that, I would probably end up having to give away spoilers. Um, that said, like, my favorite anime series is Steins Gate. If that can help narrow it down any. Like, actually, like, even though I really like the whole series, I would say my favorite might be the first episode, because that kind of sets up the whole universe. What just happened? Did we lose connection or something? No, it looks fine. Rotate our canvas real quick. That makes it easier to see if there are any mistakes or things that could be adjusted. It doesn't actually look terrible. It's look pretty balanced for the most part. that real quick even though it's minor at least small mistake but fixing that should make the hair look a bit 
more like it's supposed to. Your Kurisu coin started flashing blue with stars? That's weird. How many does it say you have now, Sniper? Oh my gosh, 127.9 thousand. That's crazy. 15,000, that's a lot too. 30,000, you're all awesome. Thank you for all being here enough to have that many coins. You're all amazing. Well, you're a good sniper. You don't have to unless you want to. Thinking of mischievous things with them. What are you talking about, Hunter? <laughs> You know, I haven't started drawing the clothes yet. Which outfit do we want to go with? So as far as like Curious's default outfits, we have like the cloak and the other robes. Um, or I just have like a gray t shirt, black hoodie, whatever. Personally, I think I'd prefer probably regular clothes for this one, because I don't know if the other options would really be relevant with an air conditioner. A trench coat. <laughs> um, I don't, I don't wear trench coats.
summer clothes and tank and shorts. Um, I'd be more likely to have a t-shirt, so we could do a t-shirt. Biker jacket with Days Bull spikes. Um, I would, but we usually keep things a little more simple. Maybe. Hey, welcome to chat, Dark. How's it going? Uh, you're guessing coveralls are out of the picture? Yeah, definitely. It'd be way too hot for that, Julius. and busy. Oh my gosh. I appreciate you being here, Dirk. Um, a synthetic scale male robe. Oh my gosh. But synthetic made out of what? Or do you mean like just like something that we would normally see or like are we talking like Something else. Wolf skin coat. Oh my gosh, Kuro. I don't think I could do that. Turns everyone into lettuce. Sniper, you're silly. Would rather not get skin for your coat. Understandable, Julius. Uh, like a robe made out of interlocking carbon fiber plates. Um, I would consider it, but that is a bit more detail than I want to put into this. <laughs> It's definitely something that would be pretty cool, though. Aw, dog costume. 
Oh my gosh, Foxtrot. Uh, how about your normal clothes? You have just a black shirt with a jacket and a necklace. Oh my gosh, with ketchup. You're ridiculous, Foxtrot. That arm looks kind of weird. Let's see here. You hate the smell of ketchup that smells sour? Uh, yeah, I guess a little bit because of the vinegar. Um, I don't usually get ketchup that I can taste the vinegar though, because that's gross. Yeah, there is vinegar in ketchup actually. Which is interesting, because it is one of the few foods I like that has vinegar, as well as one of the few foods I like that has tomatoes. So that's two things that I don't care for, but together they taste alright. I mean, unless you don't like ketchup, then they are probably not as good. And mayonnaise too. I didn't know there was vinegar in mayonnaise, but I'm also not really into mayonnaise. Uh, let's see. It's also in pickles. Yeah, I knew about that. You thought I'd do a landscape portrait? Um, yeah. It's just because usually when I do artwork like this it ends up being more like vertical and I end up having to add to the canvas which I probably will anyway but I'm trying to see if I'll need to do that as much this way or if it'll be fine Oops, wrong layer And mustard. Eh, mustard is gross. Um, you don't mind the smell of vinegar because you like pickles. But just the smell in ketchup you can't stand. I don't know what else is in ketchup that would make it smell bad. Because it's mostly just the vinegar, I think. Mayo plus ketchup. You're ridiculous. That sounds disgusting, Foxtrot. Make the AC an AC mimic unit? Maybe. We could put some teeth on it or something. Secretly turns Foxtrot into a bottle of ketchup. Ear silly, Sniper. Oh my gosh. Can't take you anywhere. Probably gonna just redraw this arm. I don't like it. Champions, 
What type of wrench are you using for the drawing? Um, really similar to the one that you sent in Discord Sniper. So that's actually what this line here is going to be. But I kind of want to get everything else kind of added first. Because I try to draw weapons last. Um, unless they are like going to be affecting something else in the image. Like not necessarily like future tense but while it's actually happening but like and yeah, so like here i would just do it last because it's not like actively hitting the air conditioner we're just kind of winding up Oh my gosh, so many wrenches. Oh my gosh, now we're just spamming wrench emotes. Does that one react with our emote wall? I didn't see. Aw, that's unfortunate. I'm trying to see if we have any Twitch emotes that are wrenches. I don't see any. The wrench is an emoji, they don't count. That's silly. Oh my gosh, Hunter just used my, I made curious you say what, redeem, so Hunter is going to decide what I say next as long as it is appropriate. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
You ridiculous hunter. Or damn you. Or whack whack. <laughs> You're so fucking ridiculous. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. And that is why our channel is rated 18 plus. <laughs> And Kuro is starting our rave with our rave frog fox. I really wish that I had something for stream so we could have our rave. Might program something eventually, but I've never gotten around to it. Oh my gosh, so many frog foxes. Curious how you would do that and if the pick happened in real life. Oh my gosh. What scary movie does everyone hate so much? Uh, I'm not sure, Sniper. I don't usually follow anything regarding scary movies because they just don't interest me. A lot of them are just too predictable, so they're not like exciting or anything or scary or whatever. <laughs> Which idea, Foxtrot? Oh, the idea about the rave. That's awesome. Uh, you hate watching the Hansel and Gretel live action movie and the Jeepers Creepers movie 1 and 2. Yeah, like I said, I'm not really a fan of any scary movies personally. So like, I guess all of them. <laughs>
what's my favorite movie? Um, let's see. Oh, I usually go with like Lilo and Stitch or um, Atlantis, The Lost Empire. Those are two of my favorites. Um, mostly like Disney movies. Because like they have the budget to put together movies that look really nice. Um, not to say that other studios like DreamWorks, etc. don't do as well. But I just really like the aesthetic from the movies during that time period. I don't really like a lot of the newer ones though, because all the characters kind of just have the same face. Um, you know, I've actually, I don't think I've seen the full Treasure Planet movie, but I've seen parts of it. I could draw lines where I wanted them to be. That would make this a lot easier. Zoom in a bit. Sometimes I'm just zoomed out too far and I need to zoom in to make the lines more smooth. What would Curie Sue look like if she was dressed up as Pennywise? Um, I don't know. Probably the same, just with face paint, I guess.
Let's see, there was a story with that one. Oh my gosh. No, I can't imagine children would taste very good. Oh my gosh, that's ridiculous, Hunter. I couldn't justify eating children for that. That just sounds disgusting. Oh my gosh, you ridiculous sniper. You bet the AC is all beat up from carries two hits. Oh my gosh.
please don't ever draw Kirisu as a clown. Uh, I don't plan on it. It's not really my thing. I don't think it really fits her personality. Right now I'm going to flip our canvas to make sure this looks right. I think I'm going to shift some of this pose a little bit. the upper body a little bit. Oh my gosh. You ridiculous sniper. Oh no! <laughs> um, Alright, so Sniper just used my I made curious to say what? Redeem? <laughs> so he gets to decide what I'm going to say next. <laughs> work, work you damn broken air conditioner. You'll be in the air conditioner graveyard where I have all my other air conditioners. Oh my gosh, you're ridiculous. And let's see what Foxtrot said. Well, unless it's for the straight to DVD Halloween special, then I guess you could draw Kurisu as a clown. But only if she has a comically gigantic clown hammer. I mean, isn't that already what the band hammer is? She'd just be walking around dressed as a clown with her her band hammer. I think that was also probably a big part of our issue here. Then we just needed this to be a bit more angled. We really want to get into the fact that we are about ready to smash this air conditioner. Actually, instead of that being straight, I think we're gonna like bend it a little bit to make it seem like it's in motion. Make things a little bit more dramatic. Alright, I understand, Kuro. Um, I really appreciate you stopping by, and I hope you have a great night.
All that laughing made you cough a lot. Oh no. like the way that looks so far. I'll come back to it later. You had whiskey came out that came out your nose? That really sucks, Hunter. I had to burn. Well, I hope your nose is feeling better soon, because that sounds really rough. What if the air conditioner thing just became an actual meme? Oh no. That would be ridiculous. I mean, we could make it a meme, I guess. Oh no. We won't stop. Got your feet both locked. You get to slack with me. Those rare wear eyes. What are you talking about? Charlotte hates her couch stairs so much she flipped around on her stomach like a seal until she could trick us into moving so she could jump off the couch anyway. Oh my god. Oh, flopped. 
Oh my gosh. Typical dramatic doggo. You didn't know she could do that. Yeah, I would be surprised too, honestly. She didn't... doesn't seem like she would do that. She loves to love tomato plants too. Oh my gosh. Charlotte is such a rebel. Flipping a couch is pretty normal around these parts of town. Oh my gosh. Are dogs allowed to have tomatoes? I thought I saw somewhere that it wasn't good for them, but maybe I'm thinking something else. Unless it's cooked. Okay. That makes sense.
Oh my gosh, sniper. You mean like I'm curious about what the tail is made out of? Or like how I'm gonna position it? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I I don't like contact personally. Um, so if somebody just touched my tail without permission, I I might bite. Oh my gosh, Foxtrot. Oh no, not the ads. Hey, welcome back, Sniper. Uh, you didn't miss too much, I don't think. Kind of working on our tail here. I don't know if I had started that when you were here or not. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh my gosh. Just realized how come you got ads somehow. Okay, so there are some emotes that are available to my followers, and then there are other emotes that are available to people who have subscribed to my channel. So, um. You most likely have access to my follower emotes if you're not subscribed currently. You have all the emotes unlocked. Huh, that's interesting. Not sure.
That's weird, because on, on the screen it's just showing text for those. Because I don't... I think it might actually not be working for you, because it is only showing the follower emotes as, like, the actual emote. Yeah, like, if you look on the screen right now, it is showing what it looks like. Yeah, we can check if you want. No locks on the sub one since you you're not subscribed. Yeah, it's still just showing the text sniper. I'm gonna make that a little wider right there. How do you restart so you don't use the sub emotes? Uh, I'm not sure. You mean like so it doesn't show them? Like, doesn't treat it like you can use them even though you can't? I'm not really sure how to change that, unfortunately. Oh, you're good, Sniper. Um, like I said, the five emotes that did work are the ones that everyone has access to if they follow my channel. So I don't think you're using any emotes that you shouldn't have access to without the subscription. It might just be showing you the ones that you did have before. Um, but like when you actually send them, it's just showing as text, so it's not actually letting you use them. All right.
Hey, welcome back, Julius. Welcome back, Sniper. Storm Lair. Oh my gosh, I can't get the tail to look the way I want it to at the tip.
Oh my gosh, I just realized I was muted. <laughs> um, so I will be right back. Um, just a couple of minutes. Uh, I accidentally drank too much tea before the stream. <laughs> well, actually, we've been streaming a while. Uh, but yeah, I will be back in just a couple of minutes. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, so let's see here. Um, I'm trying to decide on clothes. I think I remember seeing a tank top and shorts as a recommendation. Thanks, Sniper. So let's see. I'm going to go ahead and label these layers so I know what they are. Oh. Uh, yeah, I did mention a t-shirt, um, so yeah, either or, but Kurisu is probably more likely to wear a t-shirt than a tank top. But I think I will actually go with a tank top, though, just because... We're fighting an air conditioner, so it makes sense. Awesome. I hope you enjoy your cornflakes, sniper.
There's no milk. Oh no. I noticed that too. Let's see here. Oh, that would be because that uh, playlist was over, but we'll go ahead and start it again. I thought it was just glitching. Um, so that shows how much I pay attention to what I'm actually listening to when I'm working on art. Yeah, I'm still streaming. Welcome back, Dark. Time to eat? Yeah, that sounds like a good time. Since you can't say Taco Tuesday. Oh my gosh. If you wait a few hours, you can. You just have to be more patient. There's no patience when tacos are involved. I understand. That is a very fair argument. So, I don't know when you, like, if you were here when we were deciding what I was drawing tonight. Um, but we decided to go with Chibi Kirisu fighting an air conditioner with a wrench. This is our fan cannon piece for tonight, so not technically like actual cannon, but it's a fun time. Huey says hi. Why is the wrench bent that way? Um, I don't know if you were here when I was explaining or not, but I wanted to make it look kind of like it was actually in motion because Kirisu is swinging it at the air conditioner. Um, so I kind of just did that to make it like more dramatic for the effect. Thanks, Dark. I appreciate it. Yeah, um, everyone decided that would be funny since we've been without an air conditioner for like, well, I mean, we're not still without, thank goodness, but we were without an air conditioner for like two and a half weeks. Like, because before that it wasn't working well at all and then it just like completely, completely stopped. I mean, like, I'm kind of mixed on that, because I don't really mind, in most cases, not having an air conditioner, but, um, Huey wasn't very happy about it. Because, like, the Ohio weather is just too warm for him in the summer. 
So I'm kind of glad we don't live in some of the southern states. southern states are the best uh i don't know like every state has their pros and cons but um yeah <laughs> hating the 100 plus degrees fahrenheit that is fair like i'm actually kind of surprised that we haven't had more days like that here in ohio because, like, I mean, I'm not going to say that it's, like, regularly above 100 degrees here in the summer. But, like, usually I see it, like, like, usually there's at least, like, a week or two when it's within that range. And I haven't seen that. But, I mean, that's probably for the best. Texas is way too hot during the summer. Yeah, I've heard that. It's humid in New Hampshire. Yeah, it's really humid in Ohio, too. Like, usually when it's, like, in the spring and summer, it has, like, 100% humidity a lot of the days. But humidity has actually not been that high, either, by comparison. Like, it's been, like... I've mostly seen like 30 to 50 percent, but I don't know. You wish it would rain in Texas again? Oh my gosh. Is it- has there been like a drought or something? I haven't really been paying attention to the weather or the news or anything. I'll often redraw it. I'm pretty sure that's the only part of the shorts that would be visible over here. Maybe a little bit right there. What's that, TJ? I'm excited. Actually, there's a river called Paradise Canyon close to where you live, and it was full of water, but now it's getting drier. Oh no. An anthro Pokemon I see. I'm, I'm curious about which Pokemon. That sounds like a good time. Back and forth has got me 
so messed up, don't take no And the signs we've had enough of the whole damn thing that we got going. Oh no, not the ads. Feels like it's been forever since you got to sit and watch me stream. Feels like so much has happened since last. Yeah, I believe it. Things have definitely been interesting since then. Heads for the win. Oh no. Getting a legendary, that's exciting. Uh, welcome back, by the way. Um, do I like french fries? Definitely. <laughs> french fries are actually probably one of my favorite foods. Uh, it's the softest and warmest one. Hmm. What if Kiri Sue was from the moon and that's why she has a moon necklace on the moon? And on the moon there is a castle and the only way to unlock the door is with a necklace because it was a key the whole time. Oh my gosh. That would be interesting. A fox dragon. 
Huh. <laughs> Here you see, an alien. I can't even pronounce that dark. She's a moon princess. Oh my gosh. You're all silly. I'm not a princess. Oh my gosh, Dark. Queen Kurisu, oh no. <laughs> I don't want that responsibility. The queen has rejected her throne. Oh no. I guess that's why she fled the moon to live on Earth, beating air conditioner units with a wrench. Oh my gosh. I mean, maybe. The moon just wasn't exciting enough. I understand, TJ. Um, that said, we can't share links here anyway, so, um, it probably wouldn't send anyway. Give up moon cheese subjects to beat up the air conditioner units? Oh my gosh. Cheese sounds disgusting. I just imagine it being made out of rocks, because that's pretty much all that the moon has right now. Eats the whole moon. Oh no. Now it's sniper. You can't eat the whole moon. You'll upset your stomach. You want to eat the moon? Oh my gosh. That's why you don't like cheese. Unless it's macaroni and cheese. Yeah. Um, that is one of those exceptions. I do like macaroni and cheese, but only craft macaroni and cheese. So, uh, yeah. <laughs>
Looks like your box of hopes and dreams stays locked up a bit longer. Oh no. What about melted cheese on french fries? No. Box shaped noodle. <laughs> box shaped noodled macaroni and cheese. Huh. That sounds like a fun time. A cute fun time. Oh my gosh. Yeah, maybe. No. Hey, welcome to chat over tired um so tonight we are working on what i will call kurisu fan canon um based on what chat decided to draw tonight um right now we have chibi kurisu winding up to decimate the air conditioner because it wasn't working um we have a giant wrench. I'm in the process of drawing that. <laughs> um, but that said, I think probably once I finish our wrench sketch, I will have to end my stream for tonight because I have to go to bed pretty soon for work tomorrow. Oh my gosh, you saw that on Discord? That's awesome.
See you later, Hunter. Have a good night. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you have a wonderful evening, and I'll talk to you later. figure out how to fit these in or fit this wrench in Carisi's hands because the wrench is pretty wide so it's probably gonna just have to be thinner right there. more in view than it is. Just gonna make that adjustment. Oops, what is going on here? Oh. Guess I had accidentally changed my eraser to a paintbrush. That doesn't work out. Yeah, it's a big wrench. This is why we can't have nice things. Maybe this is why we have nice things, I don't know. From band hammer to scythe to wrench. Uh, yeah, my, uh, my arsenal is a bit, um, what's the word I want to use? It is fairly versatile. <laughs> His skill tree is impressive. The arsenal expands to the far reaches. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, so I think... Yeah, I was gonna say, you could have clipped it. Um, that said, I think... Like, it saves the video after the stream is over. I don't know for sure if you can save clips from that or not. Um, but you can try if you want. <laughs>
Oh my gosh. Um, if somebody could remind me, I will remind Sniper later in Discord to make a clip of that. A blink of an eye's not enough She'd rather be staying for a day So I'd rather fix it than mess up again She'd rather be burning it all now I know we will end up in anger I don't think we grew up We just became older She's ending her words ready to fire I don't think that bullets will bring back desire I don't think that bullets will bring back desire Actually, how do you share that clip because you've only done it one time and it didn't and didn't know how to work it so it didn't save. Um I don't make clips often, so I am unfortunately not the best person to ask on that. Does anybody else want to answer a sniper? I should give you a link that would have copied and pasted in the chat. Okay, yeah, that sounds right. Say I'm making no sense, a tragedy, I'm a beautiful disaster, a reckoning, you wonder how I got this way, you think I'm someone to replace, say, someone to clean up and tame, oh, some things never change, never change, oh. I just hate drawing cheapy hands, it's like I draw them kind of weird anyway. hand isn't at the right angle so that might help if I fix that you made a sticky note that works
Sniper, I'm glad you like it. To know if you'll give me a second chance But don't come on off of me, please You know I can't stand it When you don't talk to me When you don't talk to me yeah. There's something inside Yeah, there's something inside That brings me back to you I don't think you missed too much sniper. Uh, I think we are finished with our wrench though, so I'm gonna get the other parts of the sketch cleaned up. Let's see. That would be behind, so we're gonna erase that.
Hey, how's it going, Lone Wolf? Welcome to chat. You got a popsicle? What flavor? So I'm going to flip my canvas real fast. That looks about right. It's chocolate but vanilla. What? <laughs> um, right now, Teresu has a wrench and she's about ready to whack an air conditioner because it's not working. Um, that was what we decided for our fan cannon artwork. That said, thankfully my air conditioner is working, so I am glad to finally have that back up and running. That said, um, I think I'm probably going to end my stream for tonight just because I need to work in the morning. Uh, but I really, really, really appreciate everyone for being here tonight. And I will be back same time on Friday evening. So that'll be 8 p.m. Eastern time or 5 p.m. Pacific for anybody who wants to stop by then. Um, I'll most likely be continuing work on this piece unless I have something else that you would all rather see but i'm pretty excited about how this is turning out so far because i think it's hilarious um i mentioned making it into a sticker um and i'm kind of debating on including the air conditioner just doing the sticker as this portion here oh you're good lone wolf you don't have to apologize or anything i understand Life is just busy sometimes, and I appreciate you for being here. Thanks, Dark. I appreciate you for stopping by as well. Um, overtired. Thank you for being here. Uh, a sticker to bring fear to air conditioners everywhere. Yeah, you get the idea. Um, but yeah, who else do we have in chat? Cause that's who I've seen in here most recently. Yeah, I think that's everyone who's here. But yeah, I, I really appreciate all of you for being here. You're all fantastic. And I hope you want to come back next time to see how the piece turns out. Um, but yeah, thanks again, everyone. Have a great night.